What's up guys, welcome back to another video. If you guys remember, in the past I did a video using 100 summoning eyes and you guys loved it. And now we're actually back doing it again and there's a big reason to this. The main reason is because of the pet update. And the reason I'm saying this is because with the pet update they actually brought a new dragon pet or the ender dragon pet. With the epic and legendary rarity and basically what they add to the game is just that they are so overpowered. So we're going to hopefully get that pet in today's video. That would be awesome. If not, it's still alright. And as I was saying, I did this in the past about three to four-ish months ago. And the reason I'm doing it again is not only because of the dragon pet, but the meta has changed a ton. People are not using swords. People are not using tucks. There's a lot new different items in the game now since there was about three months ago. Because at that time, I think it was still using like strong and superior armor for the meta. Now it's like all tarantula armor and tucks and all of that, as I just said. Basically, we are going to be placing four eyes each fight. And the reason for that is because with four eyes, you get a higher chance for getting swords a higher chance for getting the dragon pet and overall you just get better loot with placing four so we're gonna go ahead and do 25 fights placing four eyes in today's video and if you guys did not know i actually got myself another legendary enderman pet from a drop so this is what i'm really using the money from that on i sold that pet for 60 million coins in the auction house and i spent that all in eyes i paid about 600 000 coins for each eye so in total we spent 60 million coins for all 100 eyes now quickly before we head into the video and start all the dragon fights make sure you guys do hit that subscribe button as it's helping me out and i'm really trying to get youtube rank and we're 5,000 subscribers away so anyone listening right now if you were not subscribed please smash that sub button and also drop a like in the video because it also helps me out a ton but i'm feeling lucky today i'm hoping we can pull at least five swords and hopefully we can get pretty lucky and uh, maybe even get a couple superior dragons or a few strong dragons but yeah we're gonna hopefully get pretty lucky today let's hop into it and start up these dragon fights i think i'm gonna do a little bit of an update like after half of the fight so after like 12 or 13 fights i'm gonna do like a quick cut in the video make an update of it and show you guys all the loot we have so far and then we'll proceed to finish off all of the fights and hopefully you guys go ahead and enjoy these dragon fights Now, as it did say, I was going to do an update kind of like midway through. We are 10 dragons in, so it's basically halfway through. We have 15 more to do. 
But this is the loot that we've gotten so far. We've gotten ourselves not one, not two, but we've gotten ourselves three Aspect of the Dragons, which is awesome. I'm really hoping we can maybe get five or six at the end of these dragons. We've gotten three so far, and we have 15 more to go. So hopefully we can pull a few more. And then up next, we actually have a strong chest plate and a strong leggings. And guys, I've gotten like four strong dragons so far, which is insane. Um, but unfortunately, we got swords on two of those, but that's still fine. I'm still perfectly fine with two swords because those are going for about five to six ish mil each. And then we get an unstable dragon chest plate, a young chest plate, wise boots, and an old helmet. Now, as I did say, I really hope we get a few more Aster of the Dragons, and I'm also hoping we get a Superior, but I guess you guys will see that, and I'll know in a few seconds here after we roll the next few Dragon Fights, but man, I hope we can potentially also get that Dragon Pet. If we even get the Epic version, that's like 20 to 30 mil, which is awesome, but the loot so far is looking pretty decent. Now, let's hop into the rest of these Dragons. So, all of the fights are over, and I swear, man, I have never seen this many strong dragons from one session of dragons. Like, oh my god, if you guys take a look right here. We have gotten so many strong dragons. On top of these right here, we have gotten ourselves like three swords from strong dragons. But anyways, the loot that we have here is five aspect of the dragons, which I was hoping to get about five or six, so that's kind of on point. And then also, we almost got a full old set, which I guess I'll probably end up saving because it's not really worth selling. Two unstable chest plates, which isn't really worth selling either because the prices are super low. 
and then we got ourselves a couple of protector pieces and honestly these aren't worth selling either same with wise wise isn't worth selling but young is actually pretty worth selling we got a young chest plate and young leggings and then we have the strong over here we have a full strong set on top of that an extra chest plate leggings and two pairs of boots which is awesome now here's the thing that i'm planning on doing i currently don't even have a full strong set and i'm kind of collecting all of my sets so i think i'm just gonna end up keeping this strong set and i'll go ahead and sell it if i do need money in the future but as you see we started collecting all the dragon sets this one will be superior and obviously the rest is there but yeah we're gonna actually apply this to the armor stand and eventually we'll max it out and enchant it but for now i do want to have that because there's no reason to buy one when i just grinded one myself with those eyes and then now with the rest we have i'm probably gonna end up selling and i'll keep like the wise and protector stuff add those to the armor stands as well and all the extra stuff i'll probably just end up giving it away to some people or some people in the mines because they're not worth selling like they sell for less than 100k from the auction house which is just not good at all and yeah so we got five swords which is very good but the downside of that is that swords don't go for any money anymore they go for only like four ish mil which is quite unfortunate and i am going to be 100 percent completely honest we definitely did not profit maybe if we sold the strong set we would have broke even but i'm gonna keep that one strong set so i'm thinking we're gonna make about 20 mil from these five swords then maybe another three or four mil from the strong stuff like a mil from this young stuff and we're gonna be sitting about 25 to 26 million coins maybe even 30 million depending on how much they go for but yeah we went down like 30 million coins that is why you should not do dragons but i really wanted to try getting that dragon pet but unfortunately i was not lucky enough and yeah that is basically today's video i really do hope you guys did go ahead and enjoy it and the reason i'm not really selling this on camera is just is just because it's going to be like seven clips of me having to auction stuff claim it and auction stuff so in total i'm thinking that we probably lost about 30 million coins which isn't awful you can definitely lose more my last time doing dragons i spent 60 million and i lost i think like 50 million and made like nothing back so i'm not complaining and now we can just kind of invest back into Slayers and hopefully get, you know, ourselves that Scythe Blade pretty soon. But yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. I do greatly appreciate it. And make sure you guys hit that subscribe button. And I guess I'll catch you all later. I love everything. Fire spreading all around my room.